Hey everybody, AZ80s Girl here with you and today starts my couple videos about my new strawberries, well, vintage new strawberry shortcake collection uh, that I just got. So I am excited to go over these with you um, and bear with me with the names. I'm still learning them all as I did not collect these when I was younger. Uh, my sister actually had them first. Uh, she's a couple years older than me and so the first dolls released in 79, a couple of the dolls, four of them. And then, so she actually had strawberry shortcake, and then I do recall uh, later, I, I actually got one of them, and I got mint tulip with marshmallow, and I just loved that doll. I love the smell. These are all the scented uh, dolls that we're talking about. But I'm going to be going over actually the miniatures that came out, not the dolls in this edition. So, but soon I will be doing the dolls. Um, these miniatures do not smell. They sm actually, they kind of do. They do kind of smell. Um, you know, it's hard to tell because these are really old, um, but they do have a slight scent, and now I could be crazy to say that they have, no, they do have a slight scent. I couldn't tell you what they exactly were, but it's not stinky basement or anything moldy, so, so that's always good. So nice smelling is what we want here. Now, um, I'm going to go over the, uh, the miniatures and everything here. So this is actually the display case that they had for your miniatures. Now. Every single miniature, this is full, filled as well, that you see on this table that I got uh, is mainly all singles. I don't, I think I have only two or three that are duplicates. So they made lots and lots of these. So there's a lot out there. Um, there's a couple that, some dolls that look similar to the strawberry shortcakes too. Uh, they had some type of knockoffs, but we won't get into that right now. So we're going to go over some of what I have here and then just show you how it all works. So, this is the container that it's like a little display cabinet that they sold for your your miniatures to sit in and at the top is this, these are all stickered um, this is actually hard uh, and these are stickered the hearts are stickered it says the wonderful world of strawberry shortcake okay so this is the case you will see um, either on eBay or wherever you want to buy this and it says life is very delicious so basically on the cartoon uh, from American Greetings, it starts as American Greetings cards, and then Kenner went into uh, making the toys. Everything has to do with food, and especially the berries and fruit and, and so on and so forth. So you open it up, there's a little latch in there that'll just keep it closed, but why would you want to keep it closed? You want to open it up and just to, to display things, right? Unless you want to carry it around the house for some reason, or your friend's house to play. So you open it up, and this is kind of pretty much how I display both of mine uh, on my shelf is wide open. Now, the, they were very smart when they made this because uh, it's two levels, that's very nice, and each of the miniatures, most of the miniatures, I can't say all of them have it, but each of them have um, a little hole at the bottom of their feet or wherever they are, and so there's little notches on each of these green levels that you can just wiggle the figure down on there. Now this took me a while to do because you really got to get in there and make sure they all kind of display and fit the right way so you can see them all. So these are pretty uh, in there pretty good. They're not coming out. So I can just show you what I have in there now. Um, it's, I try to mix it up per case, per display, just to show you which ones I have. Um, I pretty much, like I said, have all of them. Some have marks on them as usual. You will find that for the years and the age of these. Some have, I try to get the ones that don't have so much worn off of their faces or off of their pets. Um, I know some of them are missing some paint and a lot of this is just from contact from each other or other toys. So they'll get like some paint from another one or rubbed off and then they're just all little PVC little things. Some don't even need the little peg because they are heavy enough to just sit and display themselves. And then we can also use this to display some of the characters on there as well. Uh, to just, you know, especially this, whoop. And that one doesn't have a hole in it. So this is on a rocking horse there. Okay, so I'm going to go over a few of the uh, PVC miniatures that I do have with Strawberry Shortcake, starting with the, the ones that started it all. So you have Strawberry Shortcake, and they made a ton of her. And she's doing everything. She's on roller skates. She's on the skateboard. She's cleaning. I mean, I think she definitely cleans a lot. <laughs> I watched the cartoon today, and they seem to clean a lot. Um, that's what happens when I get you bored, which, you know, I, I clean a lot too. Um, and then we have her friend, the next traditional one that they started with is Huckleberry Pie. Uh, and Huckleberry Pie um, is not with uh, his puppy this time, Pupcake Puppy. He's just fishing because that's mainly what he does. He's lazy and he likes to fish. He is the only boy 
that is older. They have a couple little babies uh, that are boys. I think one, actually, there's one other baby. And then the purple pinot. So there's huckleberry pie, and then the other one is raspberry tart with rhubarb monkey. Um, that's raspberry tart there. And then we'll go to uh, apple dumpling. Now I have a couple apple dumplings here, and some of the paint's rub rubbed off, or she's got black marks. I think that's just either mold or it's just set in there. I can't get it out. It's just into the actual PVC plastic itself. And the only one that I have her with Tea Time Turtle is right here. So this is Apple Dumpling with Tea Time Turtle. She's sitting on the turtle. And what I saw from the cartoon is that she's too little to talk. So she's actually very good at writing. So that's what I saw there. Now the first uh, villain that arrives was Purple Pie Man. And they called him the Peculiar Purple Pie Man. Um, and so on and so forth. So this is the Purple Pie Man. He's very tall compared to the other girls because he's a man. And these are basically six-year-old kids by themselves. So here's a man making pies, and he just basically wants the villain. He's the villain that wants all their berries so he can keep making his pies. Um, and they don't want to give him them. I don't know. So this is the height difference there. Um, I have two different purple pie mans um, with uh, his bird. And sorry for those who are strawberry shortcake lovers. I'm slowly trying to learn their names of all the different characters and I love them to death so they're pretty great so purple pine and berry bird so and these are two different ones and I think they might made made a couple more but I'm not sure of those the other villain that came out later was sour grapes now I don't have sour grapes uh, villain uh, she's a villain as well that came along later and then she was w actually with a snake uh, called dregs and Dregs is a purple snake, um, and we'll go over Dregs when we do the dolls later. So she had a, a snake that wrapped around her neck that kind of was like a scarf. It's pretty cool. So there's Sour Grapes. I'm going to move these guys out of the way. Um, let's see who else do we have here. Now there's a couple I did keep two of, and this is Angel Cake. She doesn't have souffle with her, uh, but there's two. She's both in the tub. I only kept them both because she has like something put in her head here. So I don't know if it was supposed to be in a keychain. Somebody made it that way, but I just kept those both. Uh, but those are exactly the same. Um, what else do we have here? So we have Lemon Meringue, and Lemon Meringue has her flowers. And she doesn't have her frog, her frappe, frappe frog. She doesn't have her with the frog with her there. He is right in this, this one here. So I'm going to take these off so you can take a look at the ones I have displayed. So they're both, like I said, totally different uh, displays in each one. And I took a few odds there, but you can see... Uh, strawberry shortcake, blueberry muffin with cheesecake mouse. Uh, there's a, gosh, a couple strawberries. Rube, and there we go. Raspberry tart. I do have orange blossom. I'll show her to you. And then I have butter cookie with jelly bears. So let me. And then inside, actually, oh, there we go. I got apricot with hops a lot bunny right here. And that's another little uh, smaller baby one. And then the other baby one is right here is the um, jelly bear. She's got jelly bear right there. Uh, butter cookie, I'm sorry. Butter cookie with jelly bear. That's another baby one. And I had two similar ones. They just had a different shade to the to the bear's uh, stomach. So I kept two of the same of those. And then um, that's quite a few other ones. So there's marmalade here. So I'm sorry, not marmalade. This is orange blossom, um, but marmalade is with her on her hand, which is a butterfly. Okay, and then um, strawberry, I'm sure somewhere in there, that we're in there I have strawberry shortcake with her cat. It's a pink cat, and the cat's name is Custard. Um, I think I went over everybody so far. Cherry Cuddler with Gooseberry Goose. So here's Cherry Cuddler here on the rocking horse, um, but the goose is right in here. So there's Gooseberry Goose. Uh, there's Angel. There's, oh, okay. So I'm going to go into uh, the rare ones. There Now there's some rare ones out there. Um, that I don't have, or I have one that I know is rare, somewhat rare. Oh, I forgot about lime, lime chiffon. Uh, lime chiffon is usually with parfait parrot, but she's not with her parrot today. So this is lime chiffon. And then, so this is, um, uh, plum pudding. A plum pudding is a rare one. Uh, can be a little uh, pricey for the doll itself, uh, with elderberry owl. So I have that, which I can go over in another episode as well. But this is this is purple. I'm sorry, plum pudding with elderberry owl, and um, she's got her. She's 
got glasses, she's smart, pencil, stuff like that. Of course, it just it's funny how they show that someone's smart on these cartoons by giving them glasses. Uh, you know, it's like brainy, smurf, and it's just funny that they have to give them glasses to make them distinguish to be smart. <laughs> so for those who have glasses out there, you guys are all smart, I know it. So my husband has glasses, he's very smart. It's gotta be true. So, um, and so as they uh, went on, they made dolls, they kept releasing and re-releasing the dolls. They came up kind of with like an, an international line of dolls. So they made those dolls and then they did them PVCs as well. So I have a couple of those, uh, some are rare of those as well. So I don't think mine are that rare, but mine, there's one here. This is Almond Tea with Marza Panda right there. And I have two right here. That's kind of like the China version. I do have uh, Mint Tulip with Marshmallow. This is, like I said, my doll I had when I was young and I loved. So this is one here from Holland. And then we have, let me see if I had anybody else. So Lemon and Lemon Ada came with Sugar Woofer Dog. Now I didn't, I don't have that one. That's a rare one to find as well. Um, that is uh, two babies, uh, twins, boy and girl twins with a big, big puffy dog. So I, that's a good one to find. I do have uh, Crip Suzette. I'll show you this one here. Crip Suzette with Eclair. And of course she's from Paris. Can't, I can't you tell. And then there's the other one I'm trying to see if I have. Where'd you go? Oh, and right here is um, from Mexico, Cafe au lait with Burrito. Now, um, Cafe au lait, I just have Cafe au lait with guitar on this one, uh, but Burrito is like a little donkey with her doll, with, as, a, as a bigger doll. So that's uh, her there. Now the miniatures um, also, as they were so popular and getting sold and all the other different things, they made them, they sold them also with accessories. There's quite a few that came like a totally different miniature with an accessory piece. So I have three of those to show as well. And so this one here is, uh, is Angel Cake with Souffle. Now Souffle is with her here. And she came with a desk. It's a roll top desk in this, which is super cute. And obviously this is later, because these are dated 83. So they started doll 79, went into 80, 81 with pets. And then now this is 83 as they kept getting more and more popular to, to today. So there's definitely a lot of dolls out there today. Um, and they look totally different. <laughs> so you can definitely tell the difference from that, you know, recent to vintage for sure. So that's the accessory for her. Um, and then I have, uh, oops, sorry, blueberry muffin. I'm telling I'm sorry. Blueberry muffin with a cheesecake mouse. Uh, and then she's at the piano. Uh, and what I heard on the cartoon is that she, you know, she definitely has like a slight southern drawl. So that's kind of cool. And there's the mouse, cheesecake mouse. Okay. Doesn't play. That would be cute. And the last one I have is uh, Crepe Suzette with Eclair, of course. So there's the two. And she came with like a little teapot looking thing that opened up and it was a stove. So she's cooking. She can cook some things on there. So that was the accessory set there. So very, very cute. So these are all of my miniatures that I have. Um, please stay tuned, subscribe. I'm gonna have a lot more strawberry shortcake coming. Uh, there's so much out there of strawberry shortcake. So uh, for those lovers out there, stay tuned. I will go over the doll, doll, all the dolls I have shortly. I have some rare ones and some I'm still needing to get. So stay tuned and thanks for watching.